Hi, this is uh, Greg Harding Photography, and uh, today we're going to be looking at a new tripod. Um, I just recently bought this, which is a Mi Photo uh, tripod. Um, this is the um, one that's designed for the DSLRs, um, and it's uh, I bought it to because it's the um, it's the only one that sort of packs down nice and tightly. This this particular version is the uh, the Q2. Um, and as you can see, it's really neatly designed. Um, the legs expand down, and we've got some nice little clips there that clip in. There's a real solid feel to this, and you can feel like you know it's it, there's a, a good amount of tension between them. It's not floppy, um, and you can see that on the column gets just adjusted. They're just on these little turn, the um, little twist lock. Uh, adjustments and they go up to a long way actually um, about the same as the um, Manfrotto Pro B uh, 55 um, the column on it is very nice to use it's very fluid um, there's several locking features and a nice um, rotating ball head that comes with this one um, a quick release mount for your DSLR uh, for the tripod screw which is really nice. But one of the, um, the nice features of this is, apart from the fact that it folds down so beautifully and you can travel with it really easily, is that the legs can be, one, one of the legs is, uh, can be unscrewed. And if you then extract the bottom of the tripod column, You can then take the column completely out, take this to one side, and you can then screw the leg onto the end of the column, and that becomes a big monopod. So you can see there's some real benefits to this. I was very surprised as to um, uh, the build quality. It was it's extremely well built. Um, and I think this retails for about 170 quid, something like that. So it's not, you know, the dearest um, tripod in the world, uh, but it's very, very adaptable. Uh, so that's the Mi Photo Q2. Um, I'm used to using the um, uh, the Manfrotto uh, Pro B um, 55, and um, they're very, very comparable. Actually, I, th I think the um, you know, in terms of build quality, the Manfrotto is um, is very good, and I would say that this is as good. Um, the The thing I like about it is that you know it's it's just it just feels solid. It feels um, durable. You know, it doesn't feel flimsy. It doesn't feel plasticky, and it's made of you know stainless steel or um, what is it now? Sorry, it's not aluminium, not stainless steel. Um, and just everything about it just feels solid and right. So I think they've done really well to to get the um, manufacturing specs right. Um, you know the, the legs will uh, they've got these little pinch um, and pull um, levers, so you can uh, manoeuvre it into much shallower depths. So if you wanted to, you could get it really low uh, to the floor. Um, you can see that's quite low. I don't know whether you can see that on there. Um, you can switch the heads out, you know, so put different heads on this. So if you did actually want like a ball grip um, uh, you know, head, you could attach one of those. Um, so I mean, all in all, I've been very, very pleased with it. I took it out to Finland a couple of weeks back. Uh, performed very nicely in sort of you know very very. Um, extreme weathers, so minus 15, minus 20, you know, I went out uh, during the night to shoot the northern lights, and, um, you know, everything about it was, was well, as you would hope it would be. Um, it comes in its own little, nice little bag, uh, which is very nice for port porting around with its own strap. Um, inside the bag is a little zip lock, uh, which you can then there's a little Allen key that comes with it, so you can attach the tripod to it. And even down to 
um, so little tripod leg um, spikes. So if you're you know, not um, on a particularly even surface or outside and you want to dig the tripod in for extra stability, you can do that. Um, you know, they've really thought about what you know, the, the pro user would like from a tripod. Um, and I think they've really nailed it. So that's the Mi Photo uh, Q2. Um, at retailing at the moment at 170 pounds or thereabouts. You can probably get it a little bit cheaper. Um, but a very, very good buy if you're looking for a tripod that will pack down nice and easily, nice and quickly. Um, and you know, when I when I took this out um, you know, to Finland, it was surprising. I was surprised that I could actually get this inside my Think Tank um, International. Um, you know, beforehand I would have to you know, take the tripod and send it out you know, separately to all my other camera um, stuff, but you know, it actually fitted inside it. So, so packing it down, you take the column up to its highest um, and you push the legs up against the sides. Little turn of the head and then it fits in nicely, so it packs down really very very uh, neatly and you can see that's probably about 30 centimeters something like that and then it just slides within the bag so all right so well that's the review of the me photo I think it's a fantastic tripod um, you know I will be hoping to give you other um, you know reviews about other kits so um, come back and join us on the blog soon all right thanks very much